Hey guys, welcome back. This is Goddess Nicole Tarot. Back to drop you another energetic read for the um for the collective for my beautiful and handsome soul tribe members. How are you guys doing on this Wednesday night? Okay. I wasn't gonna post, but um I felt like I needed to, okay? I felt like I needed to say this, okay, to the collective, that being on your spiritual journey is really rough. Getting closer to God, the most high spirit, okay, whoever you call him, whoever you praise to, the universe, your angels, your ancestors, getting closer to those energies, it brings out the worst in some of the unhealed people that you were once subjected to, okay? People that viewed you in your karmic energies, in your karmic days, the times where you were acting out in your low vibrational self, they can't see past that collective. Some of these people think you are a liar. Some of these people think that you haven't changed. Some of these people think that you're not who you say you are just because they view you still as this low vibrational person. When you've raised your energy, okay, you've raised your vibration. You don't went through the dark night of the soul. You don't went through an awakening. You don't went through rebirths. You don't went through multiple levels of ascension. Okay. And these people still look at you less than. They still look at you as a liar. They still look at you as who you used to be and that's okay collective i just want to say that that is okay if they look at you like that it's not for them to understand the healed version of you it's all projections these people can't look at themselves in the mirror they can't take out time to really heal themselves they like where they at in their life even if it's low low vibrational they like who they are some of these people can't even stand and look at themselves in the mirror because of what they done did to people, how they've treated people, what they've done behind the scenes. They can't even look at themselves. So they project that negative energy over you that you are in this state of healing. You're coming up out of some type of uh, hurt, resentment, anger, all the above. I took me a break yesterday because I had to go into deep thought, deep meditation. Because someone I loved at one point in time was like a friend, like a sister to me. She took advantage of my love, my care, my openness, you know, my vulnerability. I was tested, okay, by this individual yesterday. I really had to go into deep thought. I really had to hear my guys. I had to listen to spirit, my whole spiritual team in order to know what to do, you know. I had to get myself grounded, realigned, just to really think before I make irrational decisions, decisions that could cost me or land me in a situation that I don't wanna be in. People think this journey is all rainbows and and glitter or peachy and creamy it's not it's not for the weak it's not i say this to myself every day y'all every single day i pray every day to come out the situation that i am When it pertains to my family, someone I, I dear and cared about sabotaged me behind my back, stabbed me in my back. <laughs> it 
it's so hurtful to know that that's really who they really are. It's so hurtful to know that. I ask God to to help me with this situation because it concerns my granddaughter. And it just hurts so much. Because especially when she's a part of you. And how the situation was done how how this person handled the situation it wasn't right it was not right when it pertains to my granddaughter and it no it wasn't my daughter okay and i'm gonna leave it at that i just want to express to you guys that being close to god and getting close to god will bring out the devil and some people Okay. I have been through so much in my life, man. So much. So very much. Do y'all not understand? <laughs> and people are still out to get me, and I don't know why. I've been good to everybody. Every last one of these people. So, what I'm telling you collective is, I'm not a perfect person. I deal with things. I deal with tests. I go through ascensions. I go to each level. It's hard. Being a messenger for God. Okay? You is you got people out here that want your position, and they don't know how hard it is. It's not for the weak, baby. The people that wants to be in my position would not stand a day in my shoes. So I say this to say this, collective. No matter what you go through. No matter how hard it is, whoever it is, don't let people get you out of your character. You go about it the right way. Listen to what spirit is guiding you to do. And that's where I'm at in my life. I listen to God. I listen to spirit talking to me, giving me signs and secret disease on what I need to do. To further interact with people. Because at this point. You start to lose. People. When you get closer to God. Because they're not on the right side of God. And I'm okay with that. I'm at a point in my life where I'm okay. I'm okay with that. Because right now. God has taken me to new heights. And I'm going to stay on my journey because I know getting closer to him is helping me out. I'm winning right now. And I'm, I, I give my thanks to my spiritual team and God himself. Nobody else. I can't rely on nobody else. Everybody I know have betrayed me. Everybody. So... I just want y'all to keep going, bro, no matter what. No matter what. You got to keep going, my loves. No matter what the devil throws at you. You take that licking and keep on ticking. Because that's what I plan to do. That's what I'm finna do. I was picking up on an investigative, investigative, uh, 
um, investigating energy, like a monitoring spirit. Somebody is always hovering over you, watching you, stalking you. That type of energy, as if we don't know, people watch us on a daily. Because you are exposing who they really are underneath. And what they like to do behind the scenes, okay, to people. And it really frightens these people because they know for a fact. They wronged you, collective. They know for a fact they have. Mm hmm Yeah, spells ain't working anymore. The rituals. Yeah. These people got health concerns now. Something to do with the numbers. 44 can be significant. 31 can be significant here, okay? Yeah. The veil has exposed these people. Yeah, but they don't want to... They don't want to drop the veil on their eyes. Veil came out in the reverse. Something to do with the number 65 or 56 can be significant. The love spells are not working. It's in the reverse. These people may have wanted you in bad health with doing some type of rituals on you. They didn't want you to see them for who they truly are with the veil in the reverse. And what they do behind the scenes. But it's all coming out now. It's all coming back to some of you guys. You know who these people are. They skate, they snakes, they savagers, they are saboteurs. That's what they do in their daily routine, their life. And think they're going to get ahead with trying to do this to a divine being. I'm speaking to my divine collectives. Yeah. Yeah. These people don't want to do no changing. They don't want to do no healing. We're transitioning here, but they, they taking themselves to an early grade. They just don't realize that yet, though. Some of them are really in bad shape because of the spell work. Something to do with the numbers 19. Yeah, some of them don't even try to abandon this, but the health concern is it's raising a lot of eyebrows to some of these people around them. Some of these people can really be sick because you left them behind. This is probably why they were eager to take you out. Something to do with 1982 can be significant here. Okay, somebody could be born in 82, 28 can be significant. You're pulling, you just, they just don't want this shit to be uncovered. What they do behind the scenes, the spell work, the rituals, the meeting up to stop somebody's love life, to destroy somebody's health, okay, to put somebody in the grave. It, 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 the science is here to bring people conflict. We're conflict in the reverse. Yeah. You expose this conflict that they were bringing towards you. They don't want to see, they don't want you to see the, they that they are the one who is in fact bringing the conflict to your life. They don't want you to know that with the veil and conflict in the reverse. They don't know, want you to know that they were the people that was trying to stop your happiness. Come through spirit. Something to do with the numbers 44, 45 can be significant. 54 can be significant. Okay, 55 could be very significant here. Something to do with 1973 can be significant. Okay. These people just wanted you. With love spell in the reverse, I just feel like somebody wanted you binded to them. Doing love spells. Want you to be trapped to this conflict not seeing these people really for who they are but i feel like divine spell then with divinity on the bottom of the deck come through spirit because i was definitely finna say something about god stepped in 1414 14 on the clock yeah he did and change your mind around because you were in rooms that you didn't see what these people were doing you your name was there your energy was there. They, you were the talk of this topic. Okay? You were the topic. You were the discussion. But you wasn't there. God saw all of this. 1992 can be very significant here. These people wanted to stop your manifestations from coming in. And they wanted you homeless out here living from house to house. Broken. Unstable. No money coming in. 
They want your inheritance to be gone. Whatever was left behind from your family, they wanted to take it. They was around here spreading false news, fake documents, fake information, false information, making false statements about you, maybe you and your children. People are so evil these days and times, the collective, they're so evil. Trick of the trade, that's what I heard. Trick of the trade. What that means, spirit? What's the trick of the trade? So, they give trick. Ooh, child. This is what they do. Jezebel. Man. Illusion and confusion. This is it. This is who? These people have the Jezebel spirit. Trick of the trade. They wanted you confused and full of illusions to bind you to conflict, to love spells, bad health, and rituals. They have the spirit of the devil. Something to do with 1997, okay? 1985, 1958, or somebody could be 85 or 58. Somebody could be born in 79. Somebody wanted you confused as to who they really are. And some of us, we went for that. Some of us went for that. And we had to hurt, hurt, We had to learn a hard lesson because these people were false in our life. They wasn't truth tellers. All they wanted was lust, greed, envy, jealousy, devil energy here. These people have dark Jezebel lust spirits attached to them. And they wanted you confused by doing these lust rituals. Okay, love spells. All types of dark rituals here. Yeah, you don't want to talk to these people ever again. You know what they done did. I, in my case, I know they sabotaged me. These are people I care for to have nothing but love for, bruh. Nothing but love. <laughs> They know you don't want to talk to them. Yeah, like I said, with child in the reverse, I just feel like these people had some dark childhoods. A lot of childhood trauma attached to these people. And they do a lot of projection because they don't want to face what has been done to them in their childhood. And, and that stuff follows you as you start to grow and become into an adult it starts to follow you people don't realize until they you know do the work here and heal themselves from the in, inner side uh, from the inside and, and and face that dark side of themselves and face do that shadow work okay face themselves in the mirror Instead of just putting on face, putting on illusions here, ask God to help them become a better person. They refuse to. They refuse to because they love being in that type of energy. This is what they love. They love doing spirit. They love doing the devil work. Yeah, but they was doing this to the grown divine feminine. Now these people are in emotional loss and pain. And they being brought. Tower. Emotional pain block. No access to you, divine feminine. You're blocking them out of your energy for a purpose here, for a reason. Because they were face. They were fraud. They wanted destruction in, they, in your life. They wanted you to cry. They wanted you to be out here uh, um, having emotional loss. Not being happy. Not being able to change here. With transition here. These people are frauds, man. They've been frauds the whole time. And your energy. For some of you, you was just too blocked off. Your eyes was too closed. You were too sleep. Your third eye was not activated. That's what I'm hearing. To see these people for who you who they really are. I now know by being on my journey who the corpus are that did a lot of sabotaging to me behind my back. I know who you are. And I also know that you watch me every single day.
but you gotta know. You gotta know that I'm protected. You gotta know that. Cause none of this shit that you sent my way, these rituals, death spells, blocking spells, love spells, lust spells, destruction, it did not work. These people do not want to change with change in the reverse at the protection. And this is why they don't have any coverage from spirit. They don't have no coverage from, they don't lost all their gifts. They don't lost everything because you still in this divine feminine energy, sexy, sophisticated, successful, single. For some of you guys, you are. Something to do with the numbers two can be significant. The number nine could be significant. 29 could be significant. 69 could be significant. That's all these people think, think about. These people know that you are ascending. You're moving up a level. I spoke about ascending right after successful and sexy. I know what I'm speaking. Yeah, these people are losing. They're losing jobs. They're losing homes. They're, they're not able to manifest out anything into their life that's good or positive. Like, like I said, some of these people even know that you got a twin flame coming in. They wanted to stop that. This karmic feminine is the main one here with this Jezebel spirit. She's definitely in your energy. She's definitely watching. We've been talking about her a lot. Mm. But you are very abundant. Something to do with 1996 can be significant. 26 can be significant here. These people know that they lost and that they're false. They're not star seeds. They fakes. They frauds. Their lineages are crushed. Their, their lineages, their bloodlines are cursed. They're dark. Some of these people come from dark ancestors that worship in devil work, that do dark spiritual. This. They're not sweethearts. Their relationships are failing. Their marriages are failing. Because of all they went up against a protected chosen one, a divine feminine here. <clears throat> all of my enemies are suffering right about now. They're suffering. And you know not and you know why I know this? Because I'm very intuitive. I'm very tapped in. I know they are. And if they're not now, they will be. If they're not now, there will be. Let's get some more energy here. This may be a long one. But I will say this, collective. Hold on. Your day is coming. Okay? Yeah. Oof. Mm, I'm trying to tell you. Hold on. Take time out to breathe, my loves. Spirit got you. Yeah. Expect powerful changes. What did I say? Come through spirit. I've been seeing 555 a lot. Some very pivotal changes is coming to these people. Live and yours as well, collective. Yeah. Keep that energy. Okay? It's gaining momentum. Some of these people that think they done got ahead, they think they ain't got to pay for what they did to you, but they got to pay. They got to pay for everything they invested into. They got to pay. Mm, mm, mm. Yep. And don't let your past hold you back. Come through sphere. I'm speaking to somebody. These people were acting out in their south node majority of the time around you. You thought they were for you, but they really wasn't. They were projection here with confusion and illusions. You thought these people were for you, but they were not. They were not. Yeah, you finna come into cycle with your twin flame here. Yeah, this karmic feminine, she thought she was up to something no good. This is the one that's battling childhood trauma. This woman has gone, went through a lot. She probably got a, also a Jezebel friend involved too as well. They all have a Jezebel spirit because luck is on your side. You protected my love. 
You gonna all have that, you gonna always have that protection ship. You gonna always have that coverage. It's protection ship. Or, uh, uh, is that a word? I just made up my own word, child. Child. Your dreams need a practical plan, but that's in the reverse because you already got the plan. You hold the key to the creator, the most high. The man that sit high and look low, you don't need a plan. It's already in motion. Yeah, what did I say? You are loved. You're loved by the ancestors in the universe. What you doing, okay? You are loved. And for some of you, they know this. These people know this. They were acting out so low vibrational. Give me one more here, spirit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They don't want a communication. They, they, the communication was the key. Somebody missed that. Somebody didn't communicate with you. With communication is the key in the reverse. And somebody was definitely two-faced. This card talks about Gemini. Somebody was a a low vibrational, two faced ass individual in your energy, and I and I know multiple people have been two faced in mine. Under the bottom of the deck, yeah, you got that guidance. You've been guided. You've been guided away from these individuals. Yeah, with guidance here, and you're steady receiving guidance from the Most High. Come through spirit. It's just like these people just thought they were gonna ruin your life and not pay for any of that shit. These people was fake. They were not sweethearts. They were not. They losing now. They don't lost touch. Yeah. Five of Pentacles, they losing. I'm trying to tell you, they sick. Some of them are really sick. Mm, mm, mm. Got an empress in the reverse here. Could be a mother or a mother figure. Take it however resonates here. Libra energy here. This is the main one. Could have been uh, this karmic feminine here. Or there could be several karmic energies. Jezebel spirits in your energy here. That's losing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ooh, child, I cannot... These is the people that would not let shit just go. They won't let shit go. Now they losing everything. These could be cheaters, overindulgers here with the Eight of Cups. Somebody is burnt out at their job. They're losing their mind. Okay. Somebody could be overindulging in alcohol, drinks. Okay. Margaritas, vodka. Okay. Brown liquor, whatever that is. Okay. Yeah, because they were very naive and foolish. They took a lot of risk on things here. And, and one being you, Divine Feminine, and didn't know how covered you were out here. Somebody now looks like an idiot. Somebody looks like they got the fool written across their forehead. Because that's where it should be. Yeah, that's where it should be. Yeah, and somebody wanted to destroy your home. They wanted to destroy your foundation, your partnership, your love life, your divine connections with the four of wands in the reverse. Now all of that is happening to them. They should have never did this. None of these people. I don't care who was involved. Somebody may hit wanted to try to hurt your children with child in the reverse too out here. They wanted chaos for you. Yeah, an ex-lover with lovers in the reverse here as well. An ex-toxic soulmate. They were involved too. So this could have been a male and multiple females involved. I'm picking it up. Divine feminine coming for you. Coming for you, man. I cannot. They so pressed. They so pressed. Ooh, I cannot. We got the uh, nine of wands here, y'all. They so pressed. Somebody could definitely be sick. You stood your ground with these people. You did. They could be sick about partnerships or their marriages or their relationships right about now. What did I say? I cannot make it up. Two of cups in the reverse. All of them sick about it. They sick about this connection. It's finna come in. If they're sick about your relationship, oh, you finna have that. You finna have this twin flame connection. Yeah, they sick about it. 
especially this empress in the reverse. There could be multiple karmic females here. Jezebel spear. With Jezebel spears, mad as the fuck that their secrets are out and what they've been doing up under this moon here to try to stop somebody or interfere into somebody's partnership. Whatever they were trying to do here, they wouldn't let it go. They wouldn't back off. But somebody knows now because they were the fucking devil. It's a group of them. I cannot make it up. There was some injustice done here. And there was some lies being told. And it now has affected these people in a way that they cannot keep up with these lies that they were telling. They've been exposed. They're out now. They're out. Oof. Somebody's stable. You see how that car fell? Somebody's stability is being affected. Somebody could be bit put out of house or home. Yeah, or, or a group. Taking out of resonate because some type of justice system here is on somebody's ass. Okay, I just feel like that is divine order, divine intervention here. I just feel like, yeah, what you put out here is what you get. If there were some unfairness, okay, when it pertains to justice or some type of unbalance or stability issues, and maybe collective, you may have got put out of your home or something like that due to a family member or ex lover here. Something is going to be justified. Something is going to go back to these people and they're confused about it. Why be confused when you know you were the corpus? You knew you were the suspect in this investigation. You knew that. Why be surprised that you getting your ass kicked by spirit here? You sitting your punk ass down somewhere. That's exactly what the fuck happened to these shady ass, false ass, fake motherfuckers. They getting what they put out here. Yeah, that's right. What did I say? They getting what they put out here. Come through spirit. That magic. These rituals. The love spells. The manipulation. The mind control with the confusion and illusions. They know what they were doing. Now they all motherfucking heartbroken. Because... Archangel Micah done made his presence out here. He was protecting you the whole time. Motherfuckers are stupid. And this is what the fuck they get. Because they the devil. They work for the devil. And for some of you, it was your own stupid ass twin flame that worked on the behalf of this man. Idiot. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Now you're being seen and recognized, publicly recognized. You could hold a job in the public or you could work in the public. There is also a Queen of Cups out here. She's out here twice with the uh, sweetheart in the reverse. And there is another person here too as well. This Karmic Feminine and Jezebel. They're so mad that you're stable. Two of Pentacles. You're, you, it talks about balance. Your stability is in check. Ain't shit wrong with you. These plans failed. All of it failed. Every last bit of it failed. Okay? <laughs> what else here, Spirit? Yeah. What they invested in was poorly done. Now they're sitting on their ass with bad debt. Okay? They're not so giving anymore. They're not so generous no more because they ain't got shit. Six of Pentacles in the reverse. They're broke. All they're invested into this magic has cost them. A King of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, they're losing their fucking mind and they're losing money. Somebody was so materialistic, so corrupt, so evil, so twisted, so wicked. All of these people get what the fuck they deserve. The whole group. Give me one more here, Spirit. Mm, mm, mm. Man, I can't make it up. Five of Cups. I cannot make it up. Sad. Broken. Shattered. Nine of Swords. Nine of Cups. Nine of Wands. Five of Cups. Two of Cups in the reverse. Seven of Swords in the reverse. The Devil. Three of Swords. They heartbroken. They fucked up. They know they did. <laughs> they know they did. If they don't know, they know now. 
hangman in the reverse all because they wouldn't let this go and they still won't eight of cups is out here in the reverse in the hangman nine of wands very abusive very toxic very sexual lustful envious greedy arrogant tyrant yeah ten of swords something is definitely inning for these people i cannot make it up I really hope this helps someone. I hope it gives you clear and concise answers that you need. Again, this has been Goddess Nicole Tarot. Remember what I told you, Collective. Stand firm. Keep moving forward, my loves. I love you guys. Y'all take care.